And it's time for more Nemeria Legends, the Iron Lord, and we had lots of fun last episode. We did a bunch of fishing. Uh, but I think we're done. I think we're totally done. So let's get out of the fishing area here. Well, I'm kind of curious now that I think about it. I wonder if the fish can actually... I wonder if we were able to use our little brain thing here. Alright, so do I put the fish in the frying pan? Cook it up. Below the fire. Nom nom, cooked fish. Fried fish, even better. Alright, we're gonna eventually have to still bake a pie for our friendly here. Friendly giant, I guess. So we need to go and give our fish to our friend. I think he was up here. Am I not mistaken? Was he? Where was our friend that he wanted the fish? There he is. Uh, I thought we. Oh, sorry. Yeah, he wants him to move him over there. So who wants the fish? That's what I want to know. Go this way. I know it's not here. No, it's telling me to go there. Okay, well that's not helping me at all. Oh, it was this fellow who wants the fish. There you go, buddy. I think one of them did. Thank you. That's it. I just need to put the eyepiece back in the telescope. Okay, let's put it back in the telescope then. Whoa. I should remember the location of the planets. It might be useful. Okay, maybe I'll take a screenshot of that. Purple, green, red. Aha! Uh -huh. So I need this here. This does not go there. So we can't really do that yet. At least it's close by, so if I have to flick back and forth, I can do that. Now, uh, when I look here again, so it's the sun. Hmm. Where am I going to find the sun? That's a good question. The sun is missing, yes. Oh, what's over here? Hello! I hear you now. You're wanting my attention, are you? Alright, well that, I guess, helps us a little bit, but not all the way to bright. We were... At least I was hoping to make a little more progress with those fish. So... I don't know if this goes here, maybe. Yes, it does. Aha! Speaking of the sun! Nicely done. And that rhymed. That was awesome. I'm a rhymer. Alright, so we're gonna have to remember this now. So... Okay, let's go back here for a split second. So blue and red are on the bottom. Blue's there. I don't know if it has to be... Exactly like that. These two must be up top somewhere. Let's see. Purple is right above it and green is right off the side. Oh, really? Are you serious? Wow. I have to actually do it right away. There we go. Oh, I didn't see what I got there. Some sort of achievement. I have a recipe! Yay! That's it? Recipe. What are we cooking up here? A cake! It's gotta be for the cake. Or the pie, or whatever. Here's our recipe. Put it right there. Alright, so let's see here. Wow, quite the long list of instructions. Uh, what? Ha! <laughs> this is awesome. Alright, so I'm gonna have to make three of these, but... The first one... Is this? Put some oil on it? Ah... Uh, better follow the recipe. How do I... 
I guess I'm doing it right because it's not telling me I'm doing it wrong, but I'm not exactly sure what the heck I'm supposed to do next. I can't get any more of this. Okay. Oh, I see. Okay, we're making layers, are we? Wow, this is going to be one heck of a pie, that's for sure. I get it. Okay, so now we need... Uh, now we need pineapple, bananas, and apples. <laughs> this is going to be a delicious pie. It's a nice little uh, decoration on top. Put in the old oven there. Oh, look at that tasty pie. I'm so glad I made a pie. Oh no. Hey dude, I got you a pie. Or a cake. Yay! The forest giant is ready to work. Now I can get to the great tree across the ropeway. Sweet, we made a cake. I want to say pie because it was awesome. So we got to ring the bell. He's listening for me. Ding, ding, ding. Come on, don't fall. Oh wow, look at the sad snail. Snail, why are you so sad? Yay, he's a happy snail now. I think I should follow that little keeper of the forest. He may be able to tell me how to wake up the spirit of the great tree. Shield. This one's sad. Aw, sad snail. I saw one of the keepers feed a snail some yellow fruit. If I could find one, I could feed this snail. Poor thing. Alright, what do we have up here? If I put another pumpkin on here, the scales will tip and I could see what's on the other end. Looks like we're missing an eye here. I bet the bar will be released if I put a glow worm on each eye socket. He wants a shield. Thank you, I'll take that. Give me his speared. Hmm, an animal skin with thick fur. If it were tanned, it would be nice for making a drum. Why are we making drums now? <laughs> How do I get one of these bugs? The mind scope. I wonder if we can use the mind scope on the snails. I want to use it on the snail. There. Now can I use it? Oh, it wants like a pear or something. Okay, mind snail. We have to find out where the fruits are. If there are here at all. Oh, he's still here. Doing his job. These are dried fish that can't be fried. Oh. So I don't really have much option for... Oh yeah, remember him? I pray you, do not disturb me. I must concentrate to hold the spell. If it grows any weaker, the monster will break free. Hmm. You got nothing for me, dude? You haven't did anything for me lately. Like really, what have you done for me lately? Alright, well, what am I doing here? Really? That was your hint? That's a terrible hint. I don't think there's any fruit in here. Yeah, I need to figure out how to wake up the spirit. Okay, time what to do. Oh. Need something long to pull the basket closer. 
It's like a boat hook. Hello, glowworm. There used to be a rope ladder here. If I found another, I could climb down. Alright, let's find out what our bug does. Glowworm bug. Inside we go. <gasps> what the hell happened to him? How did he get up there? Little shaman is in danger. I must help him. So we're gonna have to make a drumming on drums here. Yes, for sharpening. I want that fruit. It's right there. Can we use this? Yes, we can. I'll take that pumpkin. Thank you. What do we have over here? Poor drum is broken. Need to cover the pot? Alright, well... I wonder if we can sharpen this. No? Doesn't fit? Okay. Well, let's put the pumpkin up here and see what happens. Ooh, what do we have here? A lid? And a honey dipper. Probably get the lid on here. There we go, dude. Now the shaman won't fall into the pit or into the pot if I cut the rope. So can I just cut it with this? Yeah, there we go, dude. Oh no! I'm a protector of the keepers, yay. I'll take that fruit, thank you. Oh, pear. I can put this mask back together, but first I need to find something sticky. Like honey. Alright, let's go give our sad snail a pear. Here you go, sad snail. Be happy. That is so cool. Oh, I see something sticky. A honey dipper. Now it's got sticky sap. Looks like we have a problem here. I need to tie the rope to this winch to raise the drawbridge. What do we have back here? These roots are blocking the entrance to the tree. I need to move them apart somehow. Alright, let's go fix that mask then. Because we can do that. There you go. Good job. Now we have a mask. Why do we need a mask? Oh, let's find out what he wants. He wants his mask fixed. Lucky for me, I did that already. Here you go, buddy. <laughs> Adorable. The shaman wants to perform some ritual, but he seems to be lacking something. I guess it's time for the mind scope again. He wants his drum fixed. Okay, so but how do I get the animal skin off there? That's the question. I don't know. Emblem. I know it's right here, but I don't know how to to do this. That I don't know. I go back, do I? Hmm. What are these pedestals for idols? I only have this one thing here. Jim here, wasn't that his name? Jim? What have you done for me lately? I'm really getting angry now. Can you get over there and, like, do anything? There you go. Thank you. Now I can tie them. I'm not sure if I would tie it like that. It doesn't look very safe at all. But anyways, <laughs> let's move on up here. A broken airship. If I can repair this, I could get the Iron Lord's Fortress, but I don't know how to repair airships. Oh, look at that. Emblem will finally get rid of you. Does that open the gate? Ooh, that's a good thing to have. I know what we're going to do with that. How do we fix this, though? I've got to find a substitute for lifting gas. The airship won't get off the ground without it. Gas, I need. Hmm. Alright, let's go sharpen our blade. 
Doesn't that work? There we go. Now we have a sharp razor. Let's go out and... I guess who I'm painting this? There we go. Got rid of all that fur. Got myself a skin. Over here. Make myself a drum. Oh, I'll put this here, maybe? Oh yeah, there's our template. Got it. I don't know how big to make it. Put that on top. Look at that. We're making drums. We rock. Oh, I actually have to do something? What am I doing here? Repeat the shaman's rhythm, watch the changing color of the water in the pot, and beat the corresponding drum. Oh. Oh, I see. Okay, I missed it. Good grief, are you crazy? I have no idea. So they're actually not making me memorize it. That's kind of nice. Yay, I have idols! Nifty. You are cool, I like you. What do you want now? Okay, so I don't really need you anymore, it seems. You are very neat. I was more than welcome to... I'm more than happy to make you your drum. Oh, wow. The way's clear! What's waiting for me inside? I wonder. Well, let's not wait too long. Oh, go there, friend. These big flowers seem to respond to the dandelion scenes. I should take a closer look. These fluffs are worth hurting inside the flower. How do I do that? Don't know. Oh wow. Oh I see, I gotta like, it's almost like I'm using an air jet. Bird in there. Yeah, go. Come on, get in there. Good job. One more. This flower, anyways. You know. That one's done. Go this way, f my friends. Okay, now you go. Get in there. Really? Oh, there we go. <laughs> I was gonna say, like, seriously? How accurate do I need to be? Come on, get in there! Urgh. Double whammy, come on! One left on this one. Hurting... what do they call these things? Let me see what it says here. Use the cursor to drive the dandelion seeds. That's what it was. Hurting the dandelion seeds. Like cows. Okay, more. Dandelion seeds, move. Couple more left. No! Gotta get in there. Go home. Go home. Finally! Oh, I get to collect them now. Great, I can climb up the leaves now! Sweet. A ladle. There's some sort of liquid down there. I wonder what would happen if I filled it up. My ladle. Whoa ho ho! What the heck is this? Help! 
Move the maze pieces so water reaches all of the dried roots at the same time. Um, interesting. Wow, we're getting pretty darn close here. Um, yeah, hey, look at us go. Who's this person? Oh, he's bad. He's corrupting it. The spirit of the great tree showed me a memory. It wants me to free the great tree from a mechanical leech. I should look for that thing the centipede dropped below.